I'm Charlie Nardozzi, and this is the Connecticut Garden Journal. I recently visited a garden center in Massachusetts and was amazed at the variety of pumpkins. No longer are there just large, medium, or small pumpkins. Now there are pumpkins with different skin colors, shapes, and interesting abnormalities. Let's look at some of the options. Pumpkins for carving haven't changed much over the years with orange, yellow, and white skin versions. But for Halloween displays, the options are much broader. Mini pumpkins are only two pounds and fit in the palm of your hand. They become popular for small displays and accents. While there's orange, white, and yellow skin versions, I like the little pumpkin mum pumpkins with orange, white, and green stripes on their skin. Flat pumpkins look like a flat tire version of a regular pumpkin. Flat Stacker is a white variety that weighs 15 pounds. Rouge Vive de Tomps is a French heirloom with orange red skin. It makes an excellent eating pumpkin once you're done with the decorating. Long Island Cheese is a 10 pound tan skin beauty with tasty deep orange flesh. And Gerendal is a blue skin flat pumpkin that's also great for eating. For something really spooky, try some of the warty pumpkins. Knucklehead is a 12 pound orange pumpkin loaded with warts. Warty Goblin is a smaller orange pumpkin with lighter colored warts that give it a sinister appearance. Marina de Coggia is an Italian heirloom that's flat, warty, and blue skinned. The flesh also makes a great ravioli filling. Once you have your spooky pumpkins, remember to protect them from a hard frost. Many can be stored and eaten like winter squashes for the holidays. Next week on the Connecticut Garden Journal, I'll be talking about layering bulbs. Until then, I'll be seeing you in the garden.